Catherine and Legacy are up, ooh, or down after the break. <laughs> Welcome back to So You Think You Can Dance. It's time to meet the ninth of our top ten couples, Catherine and Legacy. Take a look. <laughs> Contemporary dancer Catherine is hoping to be a breath of fresh air. Growing up in Georgia, I really loved being outside. I loved being at the beach, at the river. I used to go four-wheeling a lot when I was in Georgia, and I just love being outdoors as much as I possibly can. And she'll be partnered with B-Boy street performer, Legacy. I started off as a street performer. I'm able to take that energy and performance to the stage and put it out to millions of people and they can actually see what comes out from my heart. The couple's first dance is hip-hop, choreographed by Dave Scott. Today's routine is be a story. It's like, uh, hey man, first time hearing hip-hop. They don't know why their body is moving the way that it is. The whole piece is humorous, so if you are too serious about it, it doesn't come across that way. It just looks stupid. <laughs> <laughs> it seems like it's simple to be humorous in the piece, but it's facial choreography. You're moving, but you gotta make certain gestures, and you have to really feel it and be in the moment, or else it's just movement without meaning. We're gonna perform the heck out of it. This is gonna be really old school. Put your hands together for Catherine and Legacy. And that's the story of evolution. <laughs> I always knew we were the stronger sex. <laughs> Adam. See, see, this is hot. This is about meeting in the middle. This is about, this is an interesting thing because I'm um, Catherine. This is totally not your style. We've seen that legacy. Interestingly enough, even though you're under the category of hip hop, you're a b-boy, so you're not used to taking big pieces of choreography and doing them in long chunks. So it's not really even in your style. Congratulations, Dave Scott, by the way. Fantastic work. Thank you, Dave. God love you. A lot of people, a lot of people, and especially on this show, have really only seen that nasty Dave Scott. They're like, you know, Dave Scott. But Dave Scott does like a really good, goofy Dave Scott, and I, we just got to see the sense of humor in Dave Scott. So congratulations. It was great to see. Your chemistry was so fantastic. It was really, really, really good. But what I want to say to you guys is you guys have an amazing opportunity here to learn from each other because you can learn from Catherine about how to connect things, about style, about fluidity. And Catherine, you can learn to hit and get dirty in there from him. So good job. Good job. Mary, maybe do you have something to say or is it just something? Oh, it's my life. Okay. <laughs> She's got Devils and Bam Bam were busting a move in the cave tonight! Yeah. Woo! <laughs> Holy yeah. wow! Yeah. Dave Scott! Woo 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 woo! <laughs> Legacy! You know, I've kind of been on your case a little 
little bit earlier this season and talking about the fact that outside of your tricks, you know, the dancing and the transitions weren't really there and that you needed to work on your dancing. Why was that dancing? Woo! <laughs> in such a short period of time, I really didn't think you were capable of that. You were so precise, hard hitting, so into character. It was everything. And Woo! Catherine, woo! Right. Little, <laughs> <laughs> little Miss Pebbles, whoa! And you too, in that beginning, the way you kept popping the body in all the different directions, you were really right on the money too. And boy, if I had little Pebbles to pay you, you would get a whole ton full, girl, because you really did pull it off tonight. And wow, he really got it out of you too, Dave Scott. Yeah. Woo! Yeah, <laughs> Two rave Scott. reviews, Nigel. Uh, it's Dave Scott. I mean, really, six foot three of musicality. He used his music so well, and he put it into your bodies. And I loved when, whatever you were eating, it suddenly, <laughs> it suddenly broke through to different areas of your body. Uh, and it was, it was the Quest for Fire, the hip-hop version of Quest <laughs> for Fire. It's, it's funny how our hip-hop boys tonight, uh, all three of the other ones, Called ballroom. At least you got hip hop legacy, which helped, I'm sure, better than doing the waltz tonight or anything else. You certainly brought this to life. Your isolations were terrific. Catherine, your isolations could be a little better, but because of your musicality, you brought it together. And, and as Mary said, great chemistry between the pair of you. Uh, I think you're another couple that I am looking forward to seeing develop across the season. Thank you. Oh, Thank you so much. <laughs> Only one more couple to perform before the judges have to make some very tough choices. After the break, Molly and Nathan take the stage. Don't go anywhere. <laughs> 